Hey, Josh. I'm really curious for you. This is the now the third offense you've kind of had to, to learn while you've been in college. So what, you know, I would think that's probably in a way helped you as far as just like, okay, I'm back in this, you know, I'm back in the saddle again, trying to figure out what's going on. Is that the case, or is it, or just you know, how, I guess how's this going? Um. Well, the case for me with the three different offenses, I would say is, you know, I had to learn three different ones, but yet I could take specific uh, like adjustments to my game and just like contribute them to the next offense from like so I say Auburn to Kentucky Kentucky last season to now with a new OC and I'm just putting everything together and really just trying to make it one and um you know I feel like if I can get that done and um you know I keep on striving every day as long and puts people with me my teammates with me and uh you know I think we'll be pretty good Josh, can you follow up while I'm, while I'm with you? Yeah, when, when you uh, when you have a, what are some of the things like? I mean, how hard is it to like as an individual? You're obviously you've learned a lot. I mean, you even going back to high school and stuff. You have things like you said that you can do that other guys can't do, and you picked up along the way. How how hard is it balancing that though, where you're you're trying to do something within the framework of the offense, but you're also like you know you have certain skills and you have things that you can achieve. Um, just kind of. Not say free willing, but things that you're capable of that you can kind of, you know, audible. Um, you know, with 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 right now, I mean, I'm just playing within within our system. Um, whatever whatever coach our assignment is, I just go with it. I take full advantage of it. And when that time comes where I can implement my other my other things, is that's when I do it. So I mean, um, right now I'm playing within the system, taking pride of playing in the system, learning the system, and I'm excited to get to keep working with Coach Liam. Hey, John Long. Hey, Joey, in regard to Coach Liam's offense, what are some of the things that really stand out to you? I know you're just a few days into it, but uh, you do have something else to compare it to now. So what are some of the things that stand out? You know, I'm going to be 100% honest. I think I think a majority of everything stands out to me from uh, how he sees it, from his perspective. And, um, you know, it kind of eye-opening for me because – the way he see things, I didn't see things so much at first. And so when I get to see it his way, I'm like, oh, okay, I, I like this. I like this better this way. So really just keep on gaining all this knowledge from uh, Coach Cohen and, um, you know, just implement it to my game and just try to make the team better, push my teammates, get in the film, um, you know, just take a full advantage of everything because, um, you know, I, I know our guys are really excited for this opportunity with him and uh, ready to take advantage of it. In regard to pushing your teammates, I imagine you and Bo are getting to know each other pretty well by this particular time. How how are you pushing each other, and how's that relationship going in terms of building off of each other? Right. Um. You know, Bo's Bo's a great kid. Um. You know, so we we go into it. You know, I had a I had a lot of time with him last year. Um. Getting to know him and uh just being with him. So when we get on the field, we push each other. Every rep, we push each other. And no matter what period or what uh, drill, we push each other to get better. Because, you know, at the end of the day, it's for the team's best interest, whatever happens. All right, Nick. Is it difficult taking a snap under center? Uh, no. <laughs> no, not at all. I know some people have. Like, I remember Lamar Jackson really struggled with it. But has it been a big transition for you? Um, I will say it has. I had. To, I did have to adjust to it, definitely, because I haven't taken a snap since – Um, I don't remember the last time I took a snap under center in a, in a game. So, uh, you know, I just – like I said, with Coach Cohen, um, just teaching me fundamentals under center and getting more comfortable day by day by day, and, you know, you know, I feel I feel good with it right now. I feel okay, I'm getting more confident with it, and uh, you know, so by the time I come, I'll be good. No worries. Lonnie, Joy, uh, the head man, Coach Marshall, he said that uh, he's uh, expressing some satisfaction, I guess you say, or, or some uh, pleasure in the way that you all are throwing the ball, catch the ball. Well. Obviously, somebody, you know, you're all throwing it well. Obviously, somebody's got to be catching it. So, 
So talk about some of the receivers, you know, that, that are standing out, uh, people that are leading and, and, and doing, you know, and picking up on the things that, that Coach uh, Liam is teaching. Uh, I can tell you this. Um, every single dude across the board in our uh, wide receiver group um, is doing a great job of not just grasping the concepts of each play, um, just putting in extra work and the time to really get to know it. Because there is specifics you need to do and specifics that help time us, like time the quarterbacks and receivers up. And, you know, just there's a lot of things. And, um, you know, I, I feel like every receiver in that group takes pride in their position and their role. And, um, you know, I think they're doing a great job. Coach Bo and Coach um, Cohen doing a great job of it. They're all stand out to me. Hey, Joey, I'm wondering, is there something, uh, a play in particular or something about Coach that really suits well to what you – Can you say hey, it Jeff, again? Can you try that again? You were breaking up a bunch. Yeah, I've got a terrible – I apologize. Uh, I was wondering, if, is there something about Coach Cohen's offense that, that really suits you – well, or that you really enjoy running a particular play or just something about it? Um, be honest, uh, I, take, I take pride in um, the whole offense. That's everything we put in so far in the installs. Just because not being familiar with the terminology and, um, you know, certain understanding things and the steps, you know, it's just a new aspect of the game for me. And it's an aspect of the game I haven't really got much to know about. And so when I got the chance to work with him and do uh, stuff like that, you know, it's just – how can you not give your all to it? How can you not just really embrace the role? And, um, you know, I think that's what I'm trying to do right now, embrace the role and just, like I said, just keep the teammates with me, push them, get better each day. And we got, we got a lot more practices to go. Motivation and, and, and how you want to, you know, kind of learn things and, and kind of the, the back and forth there. Um, you know, I mean, you want to, you want to, <laughs> uh, you want to, you want to come in and you want to attribute to the team. So regardless of who it is, you gotta, if you're serious about what you do, you gotta give it your all. No matter who it is, what it is, or what you gotta do, you gotta give it your all. So I mean, um. It's not hard to come in here with him being as our quarterback coach as long as the OC. It just creates a stronger uh, bond between us um, and between the quarterbacks as a group and uh, just getting to know him and how he thinks and his, his processing. And, uh, you know, I think that's a real, a really big strength to it. And so, I'm just, like I said, I'm really excited to get to work with him and just keep on expanding my knowledge with him and my game. And I know the other quarterbacks in the room are very excited too. Um, just just hearing him teach the concept of a play with a from the step from the steps wise to the progression to you know our audibles or our calls just hearing him explain that and just uh, it is it's something it's different now it's different and just you know just like I said taking a full advantage of it I get to see him every day I get to work with him every day so that means I get to pick his brain every day and really just absorb everything so you know it's, it's go. It's go time. And last one, we'll go with Jeff Drummond. Hey, Joey, you, you got working with a new center uh, this year, uh, but, but a guy you've probably had some work with in, in practice before. What What's that been like? And, and have you done anything kind of special to get on the same page with, with you? Um, my man Q, my man. Um, you know, me and me and Q did have a a good amount of reps from under center from last year, just but uh, pre practice. So we had we had some uh, chemistry going on, um, but it doesn't take away from the fact that you still have to go uh, and get more reps every day and just continue it every day. So 
you know, just him going through his steps to the left or right and me going to the left or right too with him. And, you know, just being on the same page because at the end of the day, you just got to keep on practicing it and just getting better from it. You can't just be satisfied. All right, folks, thank you very much.